Hi, this is Jay Smith. Do you like poetry? Well, you have come to the right place. I've written poems on everything from human evolution to history to running, for sailing, and some stories as well, even in Spanish. So stay tuned, and I hope you enjoy this. And hit the like button and the subscribe to the channel. Okay, see you later. Hi, have you ever wondered what it would be like to run uh, in the city of Atlanta? Well, I'm going to tell you, and uh, so now you will know. So this is just called simply running in Atlanta. Running in the Peachtree City. Atlanta is a special place for runners. No monotonous flat land it is. Hills, hills, hills. It's enough undulating ground for most runners. Hills present a challenge for the runner. They force them to concentrate on the road. Look only at the asphalt. You don't notice the scenery on the hills. Only on the flats do you have the luxury to appreciate the scenery to enjoy the surroundings. There's so many runners in Atlanta. On a cold, rainy, windy day, look out your window or watch while driving. Most likely you'll see at least one runner. Pick Thanksgiving, Christmas. There are runners on the roads of Atlanta. It is such fun to listen and while, while you're running. You'll hear the sounds of civilization on the main streets, passing cars. But go to the side streets to get away from the hustle and bustle. You'll see the squirrels, cats, and occasionally a rabbit. You'll surely see and hear dogs. What to do when a ferocious dog comes on the street? My approach is to run towards the dog, arms flailing, and yell at the top of your lungs. This offensive mode tends to scare away most dogs. After running on the same street, you'll get to know these dogs. Some are trapped and menacing behind fences, labeled beware of dog. These are the ones you have fun with. The closer you approach, the more noise they make. Some dogs are free in the street. They try to run with you. Owners are admonishing their action, but they keep running until some unknown force pulls them away. Running in Atlanta is seasonal running. This means you have to be prepared for any kind of weather, particularly in the winter. Monday can be nearly warm and clear skies. Wednesday can be cool and cloudy, while Friday can be cold and windy. You have to be able to adjust. Then there's a punishing summer, so hot you want to run naked. But it's only during the summer you feel the maximum exhaustion and complete benefits of running. In the summer you long for cooler weather, and the winter you long for warmth. But the spring and the fall are the best, not too cold and not too hot. The beauty of the changing seasons, blooming flowers, colored leaves, refreshing winds. Ah, the joy of running in Atlanta.